feels good, man. <laughs> we found our 10 most expensive cars. And on the 10 is a Gold Star Pikachu, $2,200. Wow! Nine. And it is the championship arena from the, the World Championships in 2005. $2,500. My name is Pierre Isoy Nielsen. And I'm Jens Isoy Prein. And we just broke the record for the largest collection of Pokemon cards. What you see here is a curated selection of the most interesting cards, and the rest are in the binders. Yeah, and actually some in the boxes on the floor. <laughs> that as well. Each binder is a, a series of cards. Normally they're releasing around four sets a year, and with 25 years with Pokemon, it's 100 binders. Shining cherries are good. Shining, that's always a good combination for expensive cards. It's around $3,500. Laporian, this one is in a perfect condition, roughly $3,500 as well. Wow. Number six, we have another gold star, Kyogre, as close to perfect condition as it can be, $3,550. Number five, Tropical Tidal Wave, promo card you got in the World Championship in 2005. There's only four graded 10 in the entire world with around $5,000. Number four, World Championship card in 2017. It has the champion stamp on it, uh, around 5000 Another Vaparian. So it's the first edition jungle version, around $7,000, $7,500. Another gold star given to participants in organized plays back in 2005. This was the first expensive card I bought. It wasn't as expensive then, but right now it sits at around $15,000. And number one of the list, it's another fan favorite, uh, at first edition Charizard from base set, and it's shadowless, <laughs> and graded nine, goes for around $20,000. So that's the top 10. It's surreal to have this certificate. Yeah, we have been working to reach this goal for so long, and now we actually reached it, and it's so cool. <laughs> We're not done. No, oh, not at all. But we will return with the 30 years anniversary and see if we can break our own record.